my daily life as a scientist might not be that interesting because I it starts with my morning coffee, it's a very important part of my day. And then I bike to work and I basically sit in front of a computer and I start looking at data. So most of my days are like that, but there's also the good parts of it. Sometimes I've been fortunate enough to spend a lot of time on sea, uh, collecting data for other reasons than not my research, and it was amazing. I, when I went to the Arctic, I've, I've stepped on the first time on sea ice, so just frozen sea water, and I, you know, the first time I stepped on that, it was so exciting. All the things that I've done is that in the, I've been to the Arctic during, during the winter, so no sun for about 20 days and it really got to me. I thought it would be fine, but I was kind of missing the sun quite a bit. But also because of that, we didn't have any way to do exercise in the ship and then we had one of our friends that was a CrossFit instructor. So I've got to do CrossFit at minus 30 degrees Celsius and it was very exciting. Not very good, just exciting. It's just like one of those experiences that you, yeah, I've done that, never again. <laughs>